All right, so this is a really interesting find that they went with um, this type of vacuum that uses the 20 volt system. Because now I have a ton of 20 volt batteries. And this is your heart 20 volt. So you can use that $10 off coupon. So this one, I think these are normally 120 and the store had it for 80 So 70 bucks. Um, I only bought this because $100 for this type of vacuum could be a massive deal depending how good this thing works. I mean, it doesn't say it's brushless. The motors don't say they're brushless, so that part kind of sucks. Um, so, there's your UPC to look for it. I mean, I've only seen these at one store. One of them, um, maybe because they don't know where to put them. Because this, this store had them in the tool wire area. Um... When it's a vacuum, to it be in the vacuum area. Um, so what was I saying? 40 minute run time on a 4 amp battery. I mean, it's coming with a 4 amp battery. 20 volt 4 amp. Where does it say that? Uh, oh. So you're getting a, a 4 amp battery. Devices, dusting, uh, showing it, these different methods. You know, they got the triplets all using one each. Yeah, it's got a light. You can hang it. I forgot where I was going with that. So let's, I mean, if this thing, oh, it doesn't say brushless with socks. I think I already mentioned that. I wonder if it uses the same motors as all their other equipment. Because then, you, know, you can grab one of the motors. Brushless motors out of one of the other things. Being br if it was brushless, you know, I don't think any of the vacuum cleaners have brushless. Because 40 minutes, if you have brushless, that 40 minutes is going to increase. And the power of the motor is going to increase. So the suction is going to increase. Right, let's see what we got in here. Right, this is this section. Stuff's gonna fall off. We got this attachment. Get some screws down in there. We're gonna have to screw. Right, here's your charger. There's a charger. Two amp hour charger. Of course, it doesn't say on this one. I don't see the current. It's probably two amp. Because why would you go differently? The battery. That's where the motor is. You're going to have the spinning motor, that's one of them. It's got the power going down to it. Alright. You got your LEDs in there. thingy uh, I guess this is, this is your wall hanger hanging up on
security thing down in there. There's the unit. Why is this thing over here? What's up with that? Damn it. Why is this piece of rubber over here? In the middle of everything. Is that protecting it against there? That's weird. Right, let's get into this in a second. Alright, let's take a look at this. Uh, is this supposed to flip open? Yeah, I guess it does. Now you got a rubber seal there. Oh, that's what that is. I thought that was weird. All right. Oh, all right. Let me see. I don't know if I that on camera. So you get the dirt. Dirt fills up here. You take it out on this side. And then this end. Where's the air? All the air is coming out here. The motor's in here. The air comes in here. Well, actually, the air is coming in here and blows out there. Because it's a sucker, yeah? We want to see how good the suction this has. Is there any orientation? It just goes right back in. Right back in. And everything is using these seals, so that's a wear point. Rubber. If these ever, you know, if these ever harden or get this smooth, you can always use, um, well, some people use hot water, but you could use uh, brake fluid. That come off. And you can pull it off and, and uh, soak it in brake fluid overnight, and that'll make the rubber expand out. Not permanently. All right. And this thing looks a little tricky. You're gonna have to go like this. Put that on there, and then lift. I guess push in and then lift. Otherwise, it's kind of hard. If you just do like this, sometimes it doesn't click in. So you just want to push it and then and then lift up on this side. Because otherwise, this piece just falls off while you're while you're driving the unit around. I mean, see what we got in here. Some hairs in there. Yeah. All right, so I guess you could do this, things like this. A little attachment like that, where's the battery? Get your thing. Whoops. Oopsies, I didn't know that. <laughs> I thought this was turning it on. What does this do? I don't know if that switch does. Oh. All right, so you can turn on the bottom piece. What's ECD? Maybe it's on Mac. Now that turns that on. All right, that's Mac. All right, let's turn that off. Let's detach this and see how well this thing is sucking. It's, 
it's not impressive. Um, Oh, well, it looks like I can take this piece off, huh? <laughs> Alright, let's put that back in. <laughs> oh, alright, so that lets you take this off and bring it over to the garbage can. That's pretty cool. This thing is almost all it comes completely apart. I'm kind of thinking this needs a 40 volt. Um... not impressive it's sucking but um, I don't know how well it's gonna work after it starts clogging you got the extension on there um, if this thing had brushless motors in there I'm, I'm kind of thinking it would uh, suck a lot better uh, well, let's, let's give it a little try. Uh, I don't know. Do I have any junk anywhere? It is kind of heavy, but I guess when you put it down there, that seems kind of small, though, doesn't it? All right, let's see. All right, there's some dirt right there. Oh, got it. No, I just ran over some rocks or something. Apparently I picked them up because they're not there anymore. Wow. Okay. Maybe I didn't have that clicked. Yeah. Oh. All right. Oh, I just inch. Oh, I see. All right. I didn't have that clicked in. You got to make sure. I just had that like that. You got to make sure that's clicked in. Oh, yeah, this one? Yeah. All right. So that's something to watch out for. It seems very maneuverable. This thing is probably like an inch smaller than a normal one. Than a normal vacuum cleaner. So I don't know if you want to do an area as big as this. Alright, so um was I going red? Oh, I thought maybe that was a switch. All right, so we can do this. Take this off. Wow. Okay. Well, that rock is in there. Well, it doesn't have extreme sucking power, but I, I'm kind of, uh, 
I don't know. Um, I don't have another uh, cordless one to compare it to. Um, I'm comparing it to a Hoover. Some Hoovers I fixed, but those are um, industrial level uh, with uh, like 20,000 RPM motors. So maybe it's not a fair, fair assessment of what I'm doing. Um, so these screws are to screw this up and mount it so you can hang it. Um, maybe I should clean up this area here. See what happens here. Go with the, the shorter attachment. Short attachment on. And let's try to clean up this dirt. I think we see it. I think I can see it in the camera. That dirt over there. Dirt here. Seems to be doing it. Maybe it's more to do with the, the spinning wheels. Oh, battery died. So I could just go grab a, you know, I don't have a full full charge in it. So I could just you know, like stroll over to my other heart stuff and grab a battery. Yeah, just go over my heart stuff and grab a battery. You know? I got a four amp sitting on top of a flashlight. Yeah, doesn't everybody have that going on? You know what? It, um, maybe that second power is down because I'm using a, a half-dead battery. Let's, let's give that a try. check oh, so this one's a full oh, this is a this battery's a full charge and what's this one oh all right, this one's a dead charge so that could have been the issue this um I think that was the issue uh, that this battery was was had no charge on it uh, so hundred dollars ten dollars off or whatever you can find it at your store under the hundred eighty bucks ten dollars off I mean their next thing is a drop to like 60 because that's usually 50% off and then take your ten dollars off this is hell of a worth it hella worth it all right, so I forgot to, to, to look. Wait. So you just saw, I just I just empty that and then just clean this whole area here and, and look. Look at that. So, uh, yeah. I don't know. I see it's starting to suck up past the, the seals there. Or maybe it did that because I opened it and that stuff in there. Anyway, um, yeah, that's this is um, 
man, you're supposed to do this until this stuff fills all the way up to here? Wow, that's a lot of dust to get in your house. Um, so yeah, this is, uh, this is worth a hundred or whatever, whatever you can get it for under a hundred, especially if you're using all these heart batteries and almost all the new tools now are coming with four ampers. And if you just use the 20 amps, so you're just going to get 20 minutes out of this. And, you know, and foot. Yeah, I just walked around outside in the garden, baby. And that's the way they want you to hang it, I guess. Throwing your battery in there. Like that. And then these things, these things clip in. It is a lot of weight on the, on the right side because this thing is real heavy. Oh, I have the battery still attached. That makes it a little heavier. Eight. 